In this week's video tech tip, we're going to show you two ways how you can quickly change sketch entities in SOLIDWORKS. This makes sketching really quick. If you're a pro, you definitely want to use this tip. So the first one I'll show you is how to transition from a line to an arc. So here, for example, I'll show you the long way first. I have a line like this, and if I want to do an arc on the top, I could draw, you know, like a circle here and trim it away and we have our arc. That's a really slow way, compound with some shapes, two shapes together, and then I sketch them and trim them. But the quick way to do this is using the line tool. You come up, you leave, and you go back to the point and now it's an arc. And now you're sketching a line again. So that's called auto transition from arc. I'll do it again. I draw a line, I leave, I go back, and now I'm drawing an arc. The only thing is that arc is now tangent, right? See that relationship that's been added? I leave, I come back, it's a tangent arc. I leave, I come back, tangent arc. There we go. So the arc is in different ways, right? It's what we call inference zones, and I'll draw those on the screen here. You can see this is an inference zone. So I leave, I come back, and you want to kind of exaggerate which way you go. It'll either draw it up here, or over here, or here, or down here, right? Those are called inference zones, and it's basically a nudge in a particular zone that allows you to draw the shape in that way. You leave, come back, and it's a auto transition arc, right? If you want to go back to a line, you can either go back again, redo it, or hit the A key. And that means, that brings us now to the second part of this tip. If you hit the A key, you'll auto transition through things. So A, right now it's an arc. A again, it's a line. A, it's an arc. A, it's a line. Arc, line. Now, this looks really cool and helpful when you're in a tool like a rectangle, for example. Look how many different types of rectangles you can draw. First is a corner rectangle. If I want to switch to a center point rectangle, I hit the A key. So the A key cycles you through. Look, I'm pressing the A key now. It cycles you through the different types of sketch entities that you want to draw. Like that. It works for arcs, circles, here, center point circle versus a perimeter circle. One, two, three. A to switch to center point circle, right? Slot types, four different slots. A, 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 going through all the different types. So that's using the A key to cycle through the different sketch entities or A for auto transition to arc. Now that's two ways you can use these keyboard shortcuts or mouse movements to really take advantage of the ability to quickly sketch entities in SOLIDWORKS.